A chase involving a group of teenage burglars ends in a crash. The three teenagers face charges after police say they took several items from a home on Breeders Court and then took off in a car. Police say officers saw the vehicle and tried to stop it. A nearby business captured surveillance video. You can see the car crash mm. and then three people take off. WKYT's Victor Puente is tracking the investigation in this Crime Tracker report. This was the dramatic end of the search for three teen burglars. The stolen car they were in shot across Greendale Road from Sandersville and into the parking lot of a medical supply company. Just hit my car, the Ford, and then the other car, and they got out and started running. The search began near Bryan Station Road when someone called police to report a burglary at their neighbor's home. They got the license plate of the car, and police began searching, spotting it near Sandersville Road. They say when they tried to stop the car, the teens took off. But because of their increased speeds and on these wet two-lane roads, the uh, pursuit or the attempt to stop the vehicle was terminated. But those burglars didn't stop, eventually losing control. That's, oh my gosh. That's not good at all. That's not good at all. And then taking off toward this tree line. And then I saw three youth jump out of the car and take off running. Before Cox could go give a description of the three to police, the teens were already in custody. Police tell us once they searched that car, they found evidence of the burglary inside. They say they found an Xbox, a safe, a watch, and two TVs in the trunk. They say they also found some shotgun shells and a handgun. Now police say they'll work to match the property to several different burglaries they think these three could be responsible for. In Lexington, Victor Puente, WKYT. Police say all three teens were taken to UK hospital to be treated for minor injuries before they were charged.